TGS presents Gears of War 4 Secret Achievement. I've got the codes. I'm gonna finally reach a thousand gamer score in this game with this achievement. I have 990 out of 4000. It's the last achievement I plan to get to put this game in the 1k range. Don't have the patience to go for 100% completion at 4000. So I wanted to at least cross the 1000 line, which we will do right here. First things first, you wanna load in the game, get to the main menu. Then you're gonna click start on a second controller to bring in a guest. You'll have to log in as a guest. You can see on the top right I have a guest in number one at level one. From there, uh, make sure you have min. I learned this the hard way, I went to select min on my first attempt to record this. I'm going to go into your characters and make sure you own a min. You can check your own section, make sure that you have min. Uh, if not, you can buy them. There's different tiers, so you can get a cheaper one. I got the E-Day one for 600, I believe, as I had 980. There's another one for a lot more points, but I don't use min very much, so I just went for the cheapest one I could find. There might be a cheaper one, but I'm not guaranteeing it. I just went with the first one I found that was reasonable. What you're going to want to do from here is click Versus, and you're going to be doing this in a private session, alone. Uh, it'll be a lot easier that way. You can obviously do it in a main open lobby, but you're way more likely to be shot. So for simplicity, I'm going the easy route. We're going to host a private session. Once we're in, we're going to go ahead and set the map to security. Let's just go all the way down until we reach security. It depends if you have the season pass, if you'll have all the maps. From here, team deathmatch. Uh, weapons don't matter, but we do need to change our character to min. So let's go to own the cards. You can use E-Day min. I'm good to go. The other character doesn't really matter. You have security, blah, blah, blah. You can you know, select any character you want. I don't have anything too crazy, all the typical stuff. Then we're going to click X. Get the countdown going. Once in the match, I will show you how to go ahead and deactivate the uh, laser system. Now that we're in, you're going to go ahead, you're going to run down this way, doesn't matter what the other character does, you know, just move them a little bit so they're not standing completely still. Run into here, go left, maybe spin your other controller real quick. You look at that beautiful hole in the wall, you're going to run over here, right here you're going to go ahead and press that button. It should deactivate this, giving you the achievement. For 15 gamer score, I've got the code 0.21% rare, has a variant of min, deactivate the laser on security. Relatively easy to achieve. Uh, again, just private match is the easiest way to do it. Obviously, it can be done in a normal mode. It was relatively quick to do. It wasn't too much of a major hassle or anything like that. Uh, so, it is what it is. Figured I would go ahead and take the kill real quick. But that's all yeah, there is for it, as you can see, guys. Officially over a thousand gamer score, so I'm pretty happy about that. We can obviously get a bit more, but uh, for the time being, I've decided to take the game off the channel to focus my time on more important games, more modern stuff that's out. I'm an achievement hunter. I do hunt down achievements. I have tons of games over a thousand or 100% completion. Just Gears of War 4 will not be 100%, but it will be over a thousand, so that's one positive. Uh, there's no guarantee <coughs> I'll ever play this game again, but there's also no guarantee that I won't. If I ever do, it would obviously be to try and mop up the credits and maybe uh, do some of the bounties and just play for fun, stuff like that. But there you have it. Would really appreciate it if you like and sub. 